Hi, I'm Steve Murray. I'm Superintendent of Schools for Bastrop ISD. I'm here today at this beautiful campus at Cedar Creek High School, and I'm joined up by some beautiful young ladies. These are the varsity cheerleaders from Cedar Creek High School, and we've got some exciting news to share with you about uh, something they were just involved with, but we're going to wait a little while on that, but I want them to introduce themselves to you real quick. Hi, I'm Hannah Gilbert, and I am a senior here at CCHS. Hi, I'm Avery Baker, and I'm a sophomore. Hi, I'm Maddie Tarazas, and I'm a sophomore. Hello, I'm Tori Blyb Troy, and I'm also a sophomore. Hi, I'm Amherst Gove, and I'm a sophomore. Hi, I'm Natalie Grimaldo, and also a sophomore. <laughs> Hi, I'm Ariana Alvarado, and I'm a junior and co-captain. I'm Jenna Smelser, and I'm a junior. I'm Sarah Lambright, and I'm a junior and captain. Oh, outstanding. Ladies, thanks for helping me today. We're going to talk about y'all in, in a minute, but thanks for joining me today. It's a superintendent's update. Like I said, we're here at Cedar Creek High School. I love when students join me, whether it be our smallest students or our students here at the high school level. Uh, we want to talk about a few things that have gone on just recently. Uh, our board uh, decided to take no action on going out for a bond uh, issue in May. I know it was talked about. Uh, they felt like they wanted to wait. The timing wasn't right. They got a lot of feedback from our community and our taxpayers. Uh, so uh, that'll be something we'll look at down the road. But just want to make sure everybody knew that we took no action at this time on going out for a bond uh, election in May. Uh, we're also looking at being a district of innovation. Ladies, that means that we, uh, we might have a chance to, to do away with some of the state mandates that we have to deal with all the time. They kind of hold us down about when we start school, what our calendar looks like, and things like that. And so we're working on our DOI or our de uh, District of Innovation uh, designation right now, and that's a, a, a ongoing process that takes about three or four months. So I want to let you all know about that. Folks, it is Texas Public Schools Week in the state of Texas. It's a big week. Uh, yeah, there you go. Show some enthusiasm. I am wearing my t-shirt. Now, this is not necessarily for Texas Public Schools Week. This is for the whole month of March, the power of public schools. In fact, if you, in fact, if you go to hashtag power of public, you'll see a lot of information about the March being the power of public schools in Texas month. Um, and so those things are going on pretty much across the board in the district and the state level. Obviously, we have the legislature meeting right now, uh, and a lot of things are going on with public education. All right, let's get back to the ladies here because I, I love the, the fact they're helping me. They just got back from nationals, folks. They were one of only 98 teams across the country, the only representative from Texas to go to nationals, and they finished ninth out of those 98 teams. Yeah, very good. We're so proud of these young ladies from Cedar Creek High School. Uh, just can't tell you how proud we are of them. Uh, we've also got things going on other, across the, the, the district uh, over in Bastrop High School. Uh, our Lady Bears made the playoffs, uh, played a great game. I was there to watch him play that first round playoffs. Give, yeah, there you go. Give some love to your friends from across the district at Bastrop High School. Uh, and they uh, they played well, and we, we really want to say uh, we're, we appreciate all their hard work, and, and uh, uh, congratulations for making the playoffs. Bastrop Silver Stars, folks, that's our Special Olympians, and they have done an outstanding job. They just got finished competing at the state level in bowling. They've got basketball tournaments going on now at the state level. Let's give our Silver Stars a little cheer. Now, I know you want to give this guy a cheer because he comes from Cedar Creek High School, and he, he is a state champion. Because when you make all state band folks in the state of Texas, you are a state champion, and that is Junior Devin Jones from Cedar yeah. Creek High School. And we also want to say congratulations to all the athletes from both Bastrop High School and Cedar Creek High School who were just honored at the board meeting for making academic all state. And as a superintendent, I couldn't ask for anything more that our student athletes are not only excelling on the field or on the court, but they're also excelling in the classroom. Folks, we appreciate listening to the superintendent's update. Ladies, thank you again. Let's get one more chair. All right. Thank you.